Okay, this is my rocket stove fabricated from steel. It's from upcycled propane containers, scrap containers, that I've cut two of them up. The tallest section you see at the back is a complete cylinder with the top cut off and then a steel plate across the top to blank it off. The short one there which creates the feed tube, that's one part of a cylinder and then on the right hand side you can see the oven which is the other part of that cylinder so it's sort of cut not quite in half but those two were originally from one cylinder. There's a door on the front which allows easy access for cleaning out the ash but the timber is fed in from the top and if we just go in close you can see that rockety burn in there. I've got some old bits of scrap wood in there and that log that you see there that was some wet wood that I've brought in from outside and it absolutely eats it. It doesn't matter if it's a bit wet, it'll just burn it. So there it is burning like a rocket. Within that feed tube is another small cylinder of about 250mm diameter whereas the outside is 380 millimetres and the void around it is filled with a sort of quarry waste that's like a clay that's compacted down really hard and if you look on the floor there's vent holes you can see some moisture there where it's just been allowing the moisture to come out and the whole thing's drying out so it'll bake hard in there like a solid brick that creates that sort of thermal mass and it's also in the, in the J-tube as well the vertical section that's within that cylinder there and at the top of it is a hot water tank a, a hot water jacket boiler jacket there are the two fittings that come out the back it's not connected up yet but that will be connected to uh, that's one inch BSP fittings there connected to copper pipe that will go into a buffer tank do for our underfloor heating. The flue comes off down at the bottom just underneath the oven with a collar there that's allowing it to be uh, bolted in place so if the stove needs removing you can just undo those bolts and slide it out nice and easily. that there is the oven which the catch on that is literally similar to a Rayburn it just click, clicks open and I've sprayed all that silver inside there so that's the oven and the flue gas goes underneath that, that plate and then up the flue That's a six inch flue coming off the back. At the moment I've got it in my workshop on a trial run and I've got windows that are high up and I've got the flue poking out the window and although it's dark outside when I shine a torch up there that is absolutely clear there's no smoke coming out of it at all so that is all burning super efficiently. burns the wood so thoroughly it's an awful lot more efficient than a lot of conventional wood stoves so that's it any questions if you want to know anything more about it please send me a message thank you for watching